right? Um, Shalom, all praises to Yahweh, Basham, Yahweh Shai, uh, Basham Rukar Kadash, and uh, double honor to the pastor that great millstone. Yeah, this is a two, two uh, to the point, vid, quick to the point. Um, just gonna, uh, you know, go into the scripture here. It's a quick couple of two scriptures, read that, bro. Revelation 5 and 9, it says, and they sung a new song saying, Thou art worthy to take to take the book and to open the seals thereof. For thou wast slain and hast redeemed us to the Lord by thy blood. Out of every Yahweh Shai, man, the lamb. You know, we worship Yahweh and we worship Yahweh Shai. You know, fair enough. It says, out of every kindred and tongue and people and nation. Right, go ahead. And has made us unto our power kings and priests and we shall reign on the earth. Yeah, we're going to reign on the earth, man. You know, we're gonna the, the planet Earth is gonna be um, nuclear peripheralized, pur or purified, and then um, you know by the fire. And then what's gonna happen after that? We're gonna build up the kingdom, man. You know, Israel's gonna be like your home base, if you will, the capital, if you will, the Earth, man. You know, what I mean, and it's gonna be a golden city. You can read Revelations, um, and it will tell you that around the 19th or 20th chapter, no, the 19th, 18th. Or it's not the 18th, 18th is talking about Babylon. It's around there anyway, it could be the 17th for certain. You know, you forget sometimes, but also Isaiah 60 tells you about the kingdom and a few other scriptures, man. There's quite a bit of scriptures on the kingdom. Where's the kingdom going to be on the planet Earth? The planet Earth, mate, it is made for man to, to live on, man. You know what I mean? The Earth can be a beautiful place. The Earth, you, the, you know, the air, the trees, the women, the, the food. You know, the, the, you know, the pleasures of life. But right now at this time and stage, mate, you know, we're living in a realm where Esau's ruling and he's just fucked up the earth. You know what I mean? So you're not, and we're in captivity anyway, so we ain't gonna get to enjoy a damn thing. You know what I mean? So, re, uh, so you know, read that part again. Read that line again. Okay, okay, it says, uh, and That's they sung, him, yeah. okay. And has made, un made us unto our power kings and priests and we shall reign on the earth. There you go, mates. You know what I mean? So, you know, the, in the kingdom, you're going to have the government bodies, the authorities, is Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shai, and King David, the 12, you know, you know, the 144,000 elect government body of the whole planet, man, and all the, other, the rest of the Israel and the other nations. And then we're going to start going to other, other um, uh, planets. The scripture says, in my father's house and many mansions. So that's what the earth's for, to be ruled in righteousness and to be ruled properly, man. And everyone's going to see who the Lord, everyone's going to see the Lord, Yahweh, Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai. Everyone's going to know in that day. There ain't no fucking different idols. The, the true God of the planet and of the, the Bible is Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai. The God of everything. You know, the old man, you know, Yahweh. And so that's his name and, and, and everyone's going to find that out. And we're going to be administering that rulership on the planet, man. People are, what's this about? Well, that's what it's about. You know what I mean? Or well, what? What is? What is it about? That's what it's about. You know, uh, what's the what's the prayer, man? Um, uh, to basically establish heaven on earth, in earth as it is in heaven. So that's what it's going to be. Mm -hmm. So that was pretty much the point, man. So basically, bro, you know, the kingdom's going to be on earth. It's going to be ruled by the Israelites and all the other nations. They're going to be getting judged by. Um, they're going to be getting judged by. By, by the Israelites, that is, the other nations are going to be in slavery for a thousand years, man. All of them, all the other nations. Then after the thousand years, you know, they're not going to be in that hardcore bondage, but they're going to be under us still, you know what I mean? And they're going to have to bring things in, if they, you know, the finest crops and that, they're going to have to bring it to us, you know? So that's, that's, that's just like a quick hint, a quick um, verse on that, because there's a few, many scriptures but we don't, you know, when we get in the kingdom, man, it's gonna, the scripture really says, eyes have not seen and ears have not heard. So you really can't even um, fathom it, mate. You know? So when it, so when it comes, it's going to be, um, you know, overwhelming or whatever word you want to use for it, mate. You know? So basically, man, with that, you know, that was, the, that was the, to the point there, you know? Chill out, man.